go. Tim Flanagan, the Ski Prof, and I'm here with my good friend Steve Gordon, Mike McCory from Atomic, Keely Kelleher from, I don't know, she's from Montana. And uh, so we took out these skis, and this is a basic rental ski from Atomic. And I've got to tell you, my personal opinion on it is that this thing, if you don't learn how to ski on this ski as a basic rental, then you might as well need, just give up the sport because this thing, <laughs> it's easy to initiate. It makes really good, quick little slalom turns. And Steve, what did you think of it? Well, I don't know, we met teaching skiing about 30 years ago. And I tell you what, it is, um, I had no idea and I was making you know, quick radius slalom turns and I had no idea it was a rental ski, it was awesome. <laughs> yeah, I didn't tell these guys that they were skiing on a basic rental ski. And Keely, what were your impressions? I had great impressions of the ski. I made really quick little turns and I felt stable in the, the initiation of the turn. I thought it was an amazing little yeah. rental ski, I liked it. And we, and we had the binding set really low and we made some medium radius turns on it as well. And so what's in this ski, Mike? So this is the cap fiber construction. And it's about a 16 to 15 meter turn radius. And uh, the, the reason why the rental shops actually like this ski, other than the fact that it skis so well, is that it has a really durable rental top sheet. So the guys can get a lot of longevity out of this ski throughout the years being demoed and, and rented throughout the season. Huh. Yeah. So if you're just starting out, going on your first ski vacation, look for a ski like this from Atomic. Yeah. Just call up rental shops and see if they have it because it's a you'll win your this thing will set you up for success and it'll take you to the next level mm -hmm. so this is the etl series easy to learn easy to learn easy to turn so it was great so then we also skied on this atomic this is an upgrade basic rental ski right or not a basic rental ski but well, it's a performance rental ski it's called the atomic whiteout okay it's about 77 millimeters underfoot it has a step down sidewall construction so it's actually a legit construction we use in our retail skis. Yeah, this is in, you know, throughout the line, like Correct. even the, even the rocker, rocker boards yeah, have the step call. This is actually rocker as well. So just a ah. little bit of piece rocker here, or all mountain rock, what we call it, helps out in the turn initiation. But for a performance demo ski, it's easy to ski. It's super stable at speeds. It's just dynamic. Yeah, I'd say, what do you think? We got it up to 30 miles an hour pretty <laughs> yeah, easily, easy. right? It just nice cruising GS turns, performed really well. Had no idea it was on a, uh, Performance rental ski. Performance, performance rental, rental ski. ski. Well, how about you, Keely? So I was the same way. I had no idea I was on a performance rental ski, and I was making these sweet turns, and Tim told me I was, and I was kind of blown away that that's the rental ski. It's a great ski. firm conditions. You know? Yeah, yeah we were. There, you know, it's, yep. Uh, yeah, this stuff, there was some skating rink type snow out there today, and, and these skis held very well, yeah. so. Well, it's important, especially skiing out here in Colorado, a lot of people like to demo and like to rent skis. And this is actually a new category for a lot of retail and demo shops where they can buy an ex, you know an upgraded version, so they're just on a package rental ski. Yep. And consumers can come in, get a high-end quality ski, demo it, and then the retailer or the rental shop owner also gets the, the, uh, the top sheet of this ski, which you know holds well. Longevity of the ski over the, over the seasons, the ski holds up really well, and so it's good, good all on ski for everybody. Yeah, it's great. So we just got to be honest with you, we did not go across a parking lot on these skis, which is the one ski rental test that you everyone <laughs> makes once in a while. But other than that, we definitely put them through their paces. It's good. What's your favorite channel, by the way? My favorite channel is Ski Gear TV. Ski Gear TV. Thanks for watching, you guys. Thanks everybody here for helping us test skis. This has been a lot of fun. Catch you around. Okay.